welcome back welcome back y'all so i feel like some of y'all have a new love interest coming in okay i feel like this person is kind of shy like they may uh not come off as direct could be a taurus they may not come off as super direct um but i'm, I'm just getting like some of y'all have a new love interest like if somebody has a crush i'm getting somebody has a crush on you um so let's see what this is about let's see what this is about This person could be very traditional. Um, they come from a traditional background. Show me this new love interest for the collective. Show me their energy. Ooh. I feel like this person, <laughs> I feel like, I feel like this person could have like a, a kind of bad boy image with this five of swords and this knight of pentacles. They could have like this bad boy image. Be careful because this person's just reputation, this person's reputation may not be um, good. Like when you, when somebody, if you was to bring this person up to somebody like, Oh, have you heard it from, have you heard anything about such and such? They may have a bad story to tell you, but I feel like some of y'all going to just want to try something new. Okay. Some of y'all just want to try something new. So some of y'all are going to jump out here and take this leap of faith. Okay. There's nothing wrong with being friends. Um, and just maybe like talking on the phone. I'm seeing that as well. Pentacles, strength, <laughs> the star, and the page of swords, six of wands, okay, the knight of wands, two of cups, the death card, the magician, and the four of wands, wow, I feel like this connection could give you an ego boost. Like, it doesn't necessarily have to be a full-fledged, we're going to get married, we're going to do this and that. Some of these connections aren't meant for that, and some are. But this connection right here, I feel like it could be a Leo or an Aquarius. It could be any sign, but these are signs that are just sticking out to me. I'm getting like, um, you could be hoping that this person has the confidence to say something like, okay, say something. Or it could be vice versa. This person could feel like, you know, I hope they got the confidence to say something because I feel like, I feel like this is this person energy. I feel like they want you to say something to them. That was confirmation. Now we got the page of swords here. Oh, queen of swords that wanted to jump. Yeah, this person wants you to say something to them. I'm hearing try this love thing all over again. This is what I'm hearing. Like, I'm going to try this love thing again. I'm going to try to give, want to get us a shot, this love thing a shot again. Okay, this person is really, 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 really keeping an eye on you. You got this person's attention, for sure, with the six of wands. You got their attention. I'm getting like, yeah, see this? You got this masculine attention. You got this masculine attention. He's definitely keeping an eye on you. I'm getting like star quality. 
the star and the six of wands to me is like celebrity status. So I'm getting top notch. This could be something real big. This could be something big. Okay, like I said, all connections aren't aren't meant to be romantic. You and this person can get together and create something, build something, work towards something. We're gonna see what type of partnership um this person is looking for in a few. But I do see your energy here is the death card. So we're gonna see what that's about. But I wanna see why is this person show me what's the strength. See, the challenge is the strength card. So I'm getting some resistance. Why is this what is the strength card here? The Ace of Swords, I told you. It's like got the confidence to speak up. Like this person hoping that you got the confidence to speak up. They want you to respond back to them. Okay, they want you to respond back to them. Oh, I'm hearing got some competition. <laughs> Coming up. Uh. Oh, so this person is checking out your style. This person is checking out your style. They're like, okay, well, this she, she versatile. Like, she could do this. Then hold up. She could do that. Okay, got some competition. Okay, I like it. I like it. It's like they digging it. Tell me more about this five of ones. Mm, six of swords. <laughs> this person like I don't want to let I don't want to let this person let them get away. They could be thinking like you are in a circle with with men. Or you can hang around a bunch of men, but you're independent. Like you got your own, your own independent. Uh, like it's something about you that's unique. Okay, this person is looking at you. They want to hear more from you. They want to see like where you come from. They want to know more about you. Like they want to know more about you. It's something that you have grasped this person's attention like full fledged. Mm hmm I'm hearing good job. And you this person is surprised. They're so surprised. Like they're like, wow, they're wowed by you. There's something about you that's so different. <laughs> okay. So, why is the star here? I do want to see why the star is here. This is having hope and faith. Okay. All right. Seven of Cups. Okay. This person is hoping that you would, like, drop all your options for them. Because they say if you get caught cheating, it seems like you the type that'll leave. Oh. So this person thinking about they have to drop all their options to even like deal with you, to even be on your level, to come towards you. So maybe this is why they're kind of hesitant because I do feel like a little bit of resistance is here with the strength being a challenge. But they definitely like they want you to come to them first. They sitting there watching you. They got their eyes on you. They feel like you're outspoken. Yeah, like they don't, they like, nah, I ain't gonna rush. I ain't gonna rush. I don't wanna rush. And they don't wanna seem like they're chasing, like they're chasing after you. So they're checking you out. They're checking you out. So everything that you're saying, posting, talking about, in group chats, whatever, whatever, they are eyes are glued okay now we got that knight of wands energy for future energy yeah i'm getting some like some flirty type of energy i'm getting like a little you know conversation here and there yeah lots of flirting type of energy so this person finally seems like they're going to kind of like stick out a little bit more um and come towards you trying to flirt 
They're coming to ask you if you're in a relationship. They're coming to ask you if you're in a relationship. They're coming to ask you about your past, who you're friends with, and possibly what happened. Why was there a breakup? Yeah, this person want to know all the details first before they make their move. Okay. So they want to know all the details first before they make some type of move towards you. They need to know all details because for some reason, this person is like, you know what? I'm looking, I'm seeing this, I'm seeing what she got going on, he or she, whatever the case may be. You don't grasp this person's attention, whatever it is that you that you that you're doing, um, or what you're saying, it's like wowing this person. But it's like, okay, now this person taking a step back and just watching and listening and looking. But before they come forward, I'm getting a little flirty look, you know, a little flirty look. Um, you know, conversation and this person wants to get to know you more. They want to know about your past. They want to know who you're friends with, who like, they want to know more. Okay. I've got this two of cups. Queen of cups. Could be a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpio. They realize that you're not that you're not the type to take take any BS. They see that right off the bat. They see that you're clean cut, you're straight to the point. You're not really the type to kind of like take any BS. It's something that you're showing them, something that you're you're putting out there. Like it seems like you're loving, but then it seems like you're the type that don't take any BS. So this is what could be confusing this person. Why is the Queen of Cups here? Knight of Cups. I tell you, this person wants to offer you. This person want to come to you with the offer. They got an offer here. They got an offer here. They definitely do. Offering the Two of Cups. They could be offering you this Two of Cups for sure. I feel like this is something that could be a little solid. But the thing about it is, is you got to watch out because I'm getting like a little bad boy. I'm getting like a little bad boy image here. So it's like... I'm getting like really like thuggish type of energy here. It's up to you if you want to fall for it or not. Is this your type? But I'm here and it ain't gonna take me long. So this person like, look, it ain't gonna take me long. It ain't gonna take me long. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get her. I'm gonna get her. <laughs> this person could be a fire sign, but this person could be very good looking. Um, is an entrepreneur, could have a lot going for itself. Yeah, you know, just got that go-getter mentality. Okay. Straight, very straightforward. Yeah, so why is the death core here? You can feel like this person not okay. Well, tell me why the nine of wands here. Okay. So this person could be coming to you asking, like I said, this person could come towards you flirting. They're trying to find out information about you, find out who you used to deal with, what's up, what your lifestyle is, like trying to find out more about you. I could hear you, hear you uh, setting the record straight, um, getting the truth, getting down to the nitty gritty of a situation. Because I feel like I hear, I could hear someone saying that's not true. That's not completely true. That's not how something went down. Now we got the magician here. This person is trying to manifest you. They they trying to get you to come towards them first. Like they're trying to get you to come their way first. So they won't have to do uh you know do all the pursuing. They're trying to get you to come towards them. But we got that four of wands here and the hierophant. I'm hearing someone could possibly be already in a relationship. Um, I'm hearing I thought you was I thought you was in a relationship. I thought you was already in a serious relationship. This is what this person is trying to find out. This person is trying to find out are you already are you what are you in? Like are you in a relationship or not? Okay, because they don't want to have any regrets. This person does not want to have any regrets. They're uncertain about it. They're not sure if they believe you or not. 
they're not sure if they could believe it because I feel like there could be some swirling going, you know, some some rumors going around of possibly you being in a, a relationship already. This person likes your personality. I'm getting like you kind of like got this uh, winner's mentality with this empress and the king of pentacles and the ten of pentacles. Like you got like this winner mentality. Um, and it's like you talk about it and this is like, wow, like this interesting. It's interesting. It's very unique. It's very interesting. It's very different. Give me a second, guys. My door dashed and came. <laughs> All right, so I'm back. Y'all, yeah, sorry about that. Yeah, okay, I'm feeling like, I'm getting like this person kind of waiting things out to see if they can get you to come towards them first. They're trying to see if they can get you to come towards them first. I do want to see why. <laughs> okay so i want to see why this person is kind of like hesitant like they're resisting and trying to get you to come towards them first why is this resistance so why is it so much resistance let's see let's use the island time Yeah, we got talking, interested, conversing more, awaited messages arrive, text call, email, hovering. So this person is waiting on you to message them. Yeah, they're waiting. Show me this person's intentions. Why is this person so hesitant? Show me this person's intentions. Okay. They're trying to figure out if you're still heartbroken over something from the past or someone from the past. Are you dealing with the heartbreak? Are you, you know, are you in a grieving stage, you know? Or are you wearing a mask? Are you over it? Okay, so they're trying to find out if you're over a situation from the past, okay? Somebody that you could have been dealing with. Y'all having the same chemistry together or whatever. But they're trying to find out if you're over someone from the past before they come around you, meet you, converse with you, have this conversation with you, build a friendship with you, okay? Because I feel like with Girl with a Snake, this person could be feeling like, you know, they want to look at your morals, your boundaries, like what, you know, They I feel like, like I said, they want to know about your past, like what happened, you know, maybe this was something that was put out publicly yeah i told you they want to know the truth okay they're trying to get some clarity on what type of person you are how you carry yourself what are your morals what are your goals and then we got the golden mirror they're trying to find out if you're self-absorbed like are you a narcissist um do you believe in like one-sided relationships okay because i feel like this person is they're going to run from that type of energy okay so that's what I got, guys. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. All right? Ciao for now.